Hello, my gorgeous gastronomes and vampires. Welcome to T-Rex Steel City Mukbang. Where will this food journey take you today? Pull up a seat. Let's eat. All right, guys, guess what? Happy Labor Day early. You know, that's tomorrow, but happy Labor Day. This is my official Labor Day Mukbang picnic food. I have some country style spare ribs that just came off the grill, corn on the cob, green beans, coleslaw, and baked beans. Typical Labor Day, last holiday of the summer picnic food. And some Canada Dry sparkling water. So guys, you know I want to thank you. I want to thank all my subscribers, old and new. Thank you guys so much. We are closing in on 3K like you would not believe. I mean, by the airing of this video, I might be there. Okay, so we're closing in on it and... The celebration goes to you guys. It's all you that got me there. I love you. And like I said, by the time this video airs, we might be there. I don't know. We'll see. If not, it'll be a, a day or so. Maybe, but maybe not. It's going to be quick. 3K right around the corner. Guys, I'm going to get started. I'm going to stop running my mouth. I'm hungry. I did not eat breakfast today. I had coffee and water. <laughs> that was it. That was it. I was door dashing, guys. I was door dashing today. You know, mm, whatever you got to do, whatever you got to do to make it happen, you do. So I can tell you, if you got a DoorDash to make it work, then DoorDash. If you got an Uber to make it work, then Uber. If you got a side gig McDonald's, then Mickey did. The bottom line is, whatever it takes. Make it happen. Mmm. Mmm. These sides. These sides are awesome. I don't want to fill up on the sides. This is going to be the last one. Mmm. I'll bite the corn after I check out this meat. Mmm. 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 I got the country style spare ribs because, as many of you know, me and regular spare ribs don't hit it off. I'm going to try them again one day just to see if maybe there was something else on my plate that didn't agree with me. But for now, mm mm. I didn't feel like being sick today, so. Mmm. Country style spirits. Now, these are made out of pork butt. 
just like a roast, pork butt roast. That's what these country style spare ribs are. No bone. Mm. Just deliciousness. That's all I can tell you. <laughs> What I did with these, I stuck them in the Instant Pot for 12 minutes. Let them tenderize. If I was going to do a whole cooking session in the Instant Pot, I would have let them go for about 25 minutes. With the sauce on them prior to starting to cook. Mm. But mm. I wanted to throw them on the grill for that smoky charcoal flavor. So I did, just did like half of the cooking cycle. The tenderizing part of it. And oh my. Mm. Oh my. Mm. So tender. If you don't have an Instant Pot, man, you need to get one. Telling you. It'll be one of the best purchases you ever made. I have a link on my website. Recommended products will take you right to the Instant Pot. So you can make some ribs like this. And like I said, you can cook them all the way. Or you can put them on a half cycle. And then throw them on the grill. Let them finish absorbing that smoky charcoal hickory mesquite. Whatever you got going on. Whatever you want. Mm. This is delicious. Mm hmm. Yeah. For sure. Green beans. This is it right here. Classic. Classic. About the only thing missing is the potato salad and pretzel salad. But by myself, I ain't doing all that. That's too much. I'm not going to eat potato salad on top of this. For me, it was either coleslaw or potato salad. And I really prefer coleslaw over potato salad. I do.
We had some beautiful rain here earlier. You know, the smell of fresh rain. We had that. It rained pretty much all night. Because I was awake to hear it. I don't know what was wrong with me last night. I don't know. I couldn't fall asleep to save my life. Couldn't. I have been taking Benadryl at night. Diphenhydramine. It's the generic name. That's what they put in NyQuil X or Z's or whatever. NyQuil, the sleeping NyQuil. That's what's in it. Benadryl. Diphenhydramine. You ain't got to go spend all that money for that. Go to Walmart. Get you a double pack bottle of Benadryl. Same drug. For like $5. You got 200 tablets. Versus a little bottle of NyQuil Z for 8 bucks. Don't let them fool you. Don't believe the hype. But last night, I did not take the Benadryl. Because I wanted to get up early this morning. And, and Benadryl knocks me out. It does. But I wanted to get up early, like super early, like 6 o'clock. And go DoorDash for a little bit. I'm still door dashing. Um, so I didn't take it. And I also didn't fall asleep until, I don't know, last time I looked at the clock. Last time I looked over, I'm like, oh, it's 2 a.m. That's the last time check I remember. I fell asleep after that. Woke up at 5.30. Three and a half hours later. <laughs> As if I had slept all night long. I'm like, boom! <laughs> Ready to go. Getting up, getting dressed, making coffee, and out the door I go. You know, Made a couple dollars to supplement my income. And then I came home. You know, when you receive that income from your job after a disability like back surgery, you know they only pay you 60% of your pay. Mm-hmm. I don't know how they think that you can survive from that. You know, and I do have this business started. But. With all the shots fired at it. <laughs> within its first three weeks. I haven't made anything from it yet. Nothing. 
I'm putting money into it, but I haven't turned a profit yet. But that's okay. It's okay because it's about patience. You know, it's about patience and faith. Just keep on, you know, I'm going to keep on going forward. That's it. And every visit that you guys make to my website, SteelCityOuterLimits.com, every visit that you make there helps me out. And if you start buying your items that you need from the links in my website, that'll help me even more. If you need something from Amazon, don't forget about me. Don't forget about your girl here, T-Rex. Don't forget about me. Go on my website. And make your entrance to Amazon by way of my website. Just like that. That's all there is to it. You're still going to end up getting what you want. The only difference is that you have helped my business on your way to getting what you want. That's it. Amazon pays me for referring you to them. I gotta run and turn the fan back on. It's not hot enough for the air, but I definitely should have left the fan on. I'll be right back. Now I'm sure you can hear it. But we don't have too much longer to go. I'm almost my tap out point I'm just gonna be cooler when I hit my tap out point because I was getting hot that's because it stopped raining and the Sun suddenly came out yeah that's why mm. These are so good. Gastrolicious. And since I did not eat this morning, I don't feel guilty at all about this picnic dinner. Not at all. That's the whole purpose of food management. This is what it's all about. This is what it's all about. Food substitute and management. That's it. I gave up my breakfast for this meal and a couple of beers. Now, I had a couple beers while I was cooking. Because when I'm outside grilling on the grill, sitting out on the little, you know, carport, I 
listening to crickets and the chicken across the street with no voice trying to crow <laughs> my neighbor's chicken <laughs> beers go with that that little country setting beers go with it So if I gotta just get breakfast to have my couple of beers while I'm cooking out, I'm gonna do it. Food management. Food management also includes drinks. Alright, so you know beer might not be your thing, but if wine is or a cocktail. And you can do the same thing. Like, don't have breakfast. You can go ahead and have your cocktail. Even if it's two or three of them. Just like that. I'm really full. Mm hmm. This was good. Really good. Mm. Well, guys. Peace out, my gastronomes and vampires. I will see you soon.